finally, Yvonne Nelson has come out with a date, time, venue, duration, and reason for the protest, which she wants to have, which is known as the Dunso Must End protest or demonstration, which she says that it will be in the form of a video. She notified the Ghana police about it on Thursday on the letter I'll show to you, which she posted on X, formerly called Twitter, Charlie. I think Ghanaians need to value your nails and she is an asset who we all as Ghanaians need to protect. In fact, we Ghanaians need to build for Nelson a statue. In fact, if no one at all does that, I, with my own money, someday build a statue for Yvonne Nelson. For me, I wouldn't lie like Sarko there who told Esu that he would build him a statue in Kumasi. So without me talking that much, let me take you through the letter and then we'll continue from there. Let me state this. Now, if you want to hold a demonstration or a protest, you don't need the permission of the Ghana police. All you have to do is to notify the police as Ivo Nelson did, which I mean, I'll show you in the letter she posted on X. Now mind, before I also read you the letter, please and please again, I mean, I was away for like two months plus and so I wasn't posting content on this channel. And so YouTubers, I mean, pushed my channel down. So it's my post content. I mean, they don't recommend it to people. Please like, like this video for me. Comment as well, share this video and very important to me, subscribers, so that, I mean, this YouTube would push the video. So let me take you through the letter. Yes, so now let's dive right into the letter. But then before we do that, let me say this. Yvonne Nelson is the Yasan of our time and we need to protect her at all costs because she is a national, national asset. If you could see there, you see that I was received. Yes. Thursday, 9th May 20, 2024. The Inspector General of Police, Ghana Police Service, Accra, hashtag Dunso must stop. Notice of intention to exercise constitutional rights under Article 21.1D and F of the 1992 Constitution. We write with, with reference to Section 1 of the Public Order Act, Act 491, which provides that any person who desires to hold any special event within the meaning of that act in any public place shall notify the police of its intention not less than five days before the date of the special event. In this connection, kindly take note that A. The special event will be held on 25th May 2024. B. To demonstrate our frustrations over the unacceptable erratic electricity supply in bracket doom so c the special event will be will be in the nature of a vigil d we have carefully chosen the revolution square as the venue because of its historical significance and its proximity to the seat of government to give the president an ocular evidence of the debilitating effects of the erratic power supply in bracket doom so on us e the organizers anticipate that the people will assemble from 8 30 a.m and f the crowd will disperse at 12 midnight signed Yvonne Nelson then her number is there signed Salom Dramani Dramadu and signed Henry Osei Akoto yes Charlie, I like the way she is. Now, if you or if you looked at the letter carefully, the heading, they said what? Notice. Yes. Now, if you want to hold a protest, all you all you need to do is to just notify the Ghana police about it. You don't need their permission. This is a very very I mean good I mean initiative. Now, if if you could remember a few days ago, Ivo Nelson dropped a letter. Charlie, that one said be plenty where she called out the names of people. I mean, she organized the first Doomsaw sort of video with back in 2015. And so I think I think this is, I mean, a selfless thing which all Ghanaians need, need to, I mean, be part of. Now, without me talking that much, let's listen to this single parent, what Doomsaw sort of did to her. I, I won't talk that much. If, if, the, if what you see does not motivate you enough to come and join Yvonne Nelson, organize those 
protest. Now, then it means that, I mean, you are not human. So let's go and listen to this woman. Come back and then we'll continue from there. But then before we go, don't forget to like this video, comment as well, share this video, and very important to me, subscribe. I think I have to state this before I show you the video and audio as well. Now, that video is not mine. It's a video that belongs to 3FM. Now, let's go and listen to this single parent. What do they do to her and her business and what she's going through with the kid as well? Again, don't forget to like this video, comment as well, share this video, and very important to me, subscribe. And then when we come back, I'll take you through the Public Order Act as well, and also what the Constitution says about demonstration. It is your right. So let's go and listen to the video. Come back and I'll continue from there. Let's go. Good morning, Mr. Johnny. Hello, madam. How are you? Mr. Johnny, we are not fine. Oh. We are not fine at all, at all. All we are just saying that they should bring out a timetable. Hmm. Like, in the end school year, like, I'm not even lying. Hmm. See, I saw an ice cream cake. Okay. And drunk. Ice cream cake, they bought us 100. Because my colleague, now I'm in the fall. We end on my life. Right. So she brought her to my place. Mm-hmm. And she didn't do my life. We have we have children. Oh Baba come your Baba come your shen. If you see a baby day, you see a day at some point you see why, why, why? Now no more is here. Now no more is ill. We could not go in fashion. That that is no like. We we open you ho. Why, 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 why? We are killing them so. Hey. Three FM. Do you have to like? Do have to go in peace like this in our own country? Why? Oh. Are you going to look at their children to be ill? I want to be in the for to say that you are young Oh, sorry. Sorry, yo. I'm sorry about your situation. I'm sorry. And that's uh, a caller here on Sunrise on 3FM 92.7. So let's go through the public contact. I just want you to know that what Yvonne Nelson is doing um, or wants to do is legal and then the law supports it. As I read to you earlier, the constitution I mean, is behind you. The public order act too, I mean, is behind you as well. Now let me take you through the public order act. Act 491. Now it says that the public order act, act 1994, an act, an act. <laughs> To make provision for maintenance of public order and related purposes. Date of assent, 30th December 1994. Be it an enacted by Parliament as follows. Part 1. Holding of special events. Section 1. Notification to police of special event. 1. It says that any person who desires to hold any special event within the meaning of this act in any public place shall notify the police of its intention not less than five days before the date of the special event yes and which means that i mean even nelson and in the group i mean they've given even more than five days because the protest would be on the 25th of this month number two it says that the notification shall be in writing and signed by or on behalf of the organizers of the special event and shall specify a the place and hour of the special event which they have done already and then they also wrote some I mean, a letter as well b the nature of the special event which even Nelson described as a vigil the time of commencement which she said it to be from 8 a.m the proposed route and destination if any of course she has given the route and destination as well and e proposed Time of closure of the event, which they also mentioned that it will do close at midnight. Yes. Number three it says that the, the notification shall be submitted to a police officer not below the rank of assistant superintendent of police or other police officer responsible for the nearest police station to the location of the proposed special event. Yes. Okay. And even this one, they went ahead to submit to the IGP himself, Dr. Dampari. Yes. And then number four says that where a police officer notified of a special event under subsection one has reasonable 
grounds to be to believe that the special event is held if held may lead to violence or endanger public defense public order public safety public health or the running of essential services or violate the rights and freedoms of other persons he may request the organizers to postpone the special event to any other date or to relocate the special event so as i read to you if the police think that i mean if they have any reasonable reason believe that this protest will disturb public peace public order public health as well okay they might tell the organizers to i mean relocate the location or change the date or the time or whatever it is okay yes my five he says that an organizer requested under subsection four to postpone or relocate the holding of a special event shall within 48 hours of the request notify the police officer in writing of his willingness to comply so if the police think that i mean if the police made a request that i mean the organizers should change their i mean venue or time and then the people that organized or want to organize the protest are against it they might write back the police within 48 hours and my six where the organizers refuse to comply with the request under subsection four or fail to notify the police officer in accordance with subsection five the police may apply to any judge or a chairman of a tribunal for an order to prohibit the holding of the special event on the proposed date or the proposed location yes so it goes on and on and on and I would like to end it. But then if in case you need me to send you the Public Order Act, you can just leave your email in the comment section below so that you will read the full Public Order Act as well. Yes. So I think, come on, guys, we can do this. I want you all to come out and support everyone else. And this is just a selfless cause to help us all as Ghanaians because this government, I mean, they're taking Ghanaians for a ride. They don't respect us, okay? Those same things we they campaigned on against the Eswa Jomama government are the same thing that which they are doing, and they are even doing worse, okay? Now let me end there. Let me know what you think. Also, like this video. I beg you, as I mentioned earlier, YouTube has shown my channel somewhere, and so if you don't like, comment, share, and subscribe. I mean, my channel wouldn't come up again, okay? So again, please like like this video for me. Comment as well. Share this video. And very important to me, subscribe also because I, I have been away for a long time and I'm back now. I have to go and do with, deal with some personal issues which I'll share with you when sometime later. Yes, so now let me end it again. Don't forget to like this video, comment as well, or share this video. And very important to me, subscribe. So see you on the, on the 25th. Now, if anything else comes up, I will let you know. Again, please make it a point to come on the 25th and join Von Nelson and others as well so that we tell this government that we are not happy with how they are i mean playing with their lives i said all right so see my next video do now let me also know how the doom so is affecting you are you also experiencing the doom so how is the doom so affecting you and your business and people that you know so see you in my next video bye